Hey, happy Monday. My name is Kim, and thank you all for watching my first Tweet Find video here last week. It looks like I'll be the Monday blogger now, so I'll be bringing you the tech news you might have missed. But before I get to that, I have an extremely important question for you. Do you like my new hoodie? I swear revenge on the Templars. Okay, well, obviously I can't do my job with the hood on, nor can I do an Italian accent. Today's first story is something you may have heard about in development already. It's the $25 credit card sized single board computer known as Raspberry Pi. Pi, as in 3.14159265353, and baked pastry. Delicious. The tiny PCB connects to a television or monitor, has a 700 megahertz 11 ARM processor, and runs on a stripped down version of Linux. It can play 1080p video and run games like Quake which ironically costs as much as the computer itself. Now, we've known about this developing for a while, but the update is that it will be released in an online store in about a month, and the firm is saying that they're hoping to have fresh new batches of Pi available every month or so following. The executive director of the company is actually even encouraging Chinese knockoffs of the product because their real goal is to encourage interest in computer science. So maybe they can replace those fake Apple stores with Raspberry stores and not get sued. I'm just saying it wouldn't be that hard to retrofit the sign. Also, in fastly upcoming tiny technology is the first ever smartwatch. And I don't mean the iPod Nanos people wear as watches, these are for real. Italian design company I'm, as in the contraction of I am, announced the I'm watch, which besides cringeworthy grammar features an aluminum body, multiple colors, and Android technology. It runs on a customized interface and tethers to a smartphone to handle calls, SMS, music, and apps. It's not designed to replace a smartphone, but immediately give you safe and secure access to all its features. And if you wear a tuxedo, you're basically James Bond. The I'm Watch is already available in the European market, ranging from $322 for the basic version to over $15,000 if you're more into diamonds, gold, and selling your house. The watch does have a slot at CES, which is coming up very soon. If you're going, it's a must-see. Well, that's it for today. Please be sure to watch Sassy and Schmidt's videos coming up later this week right here on TweetFind, and follow us on Twitter. Until next time.